That's right, Dan and Aja, parts of Brindley Mountain Primary School are untouched. Now, there are some parts of this school on other sides of the school, um, several wings that are untouched. But take a look at this window. This faces the baseball fields at Brindley Mountain. As you can tell, these windows are completely shattered. You can see nothing but insulation coming from the walls. If you look inside even further, you can see that these walls are caved inward. But something that I do want to show you that upset lots of students I spoke with today is take a look at this devastation. This was the lunchroom here at Brinley Mountain School. Like I said, this upset lots of children here. This is, some, this is a place they always went to during the day. Right now you can see nothing but coloring books, chairs, and other books scattered on the ground. I spoke with two students today, one from first grade and one from second grade here at the school, and here's what their parents told them. That it was destroyed and they were just glad that we weren't in it on the school day. What does it look like to you? Destroyed. Gone. It's gone. Now, several parents that I spoke with told me that their child was emotionally distraught when they saw photos and when they saw this devastation in person. And now, the superintendent confirmed to us that 17 classrooms, the library, the lunchroom that sits right here, and other offices were impacted by this devastation from the tornado. Reporting live in Union Grove, Shosh Bedrosian, Way 31 News.